All right, so we are in Palmetto Dunes, probably about five tenths of a mile from the beach, maybe six tenths of a mile from the beach. And we are visiting a little dead end road in the Mariner section, which is the North Gate. And I know this because I live right up the street. This is four upwind. So I just want you to look at the property itself. And I'm just gonna tell you ahead of time, it needs some work, but it's priced very appropriately for right now. So this is a three bedroom, three full bath at 1.25 million. So I'm gonna tell you that that is a bargain. And I know that that's a lot of money, but right now, in this current market, this one you really should think about, especially because of the location. Elevation looks good. I'll pull all the documents if you're interested. Obviously, it needs some landscaping. Outside doesn't look too bad other than the roof. I have to get the age on the roof. Looks like it needs blown and a soft wash. Okay, it looks like we have our irrigation here. We have a door going out. Let's check this out. So this is just a um, patio area, service yard area. Nothing really in there other than garbage cans and propane. So that propane must be for the pool. You can see there is pull down here. So this looks like a pull down ladder or some type of storage right there. We have storage here. So some built in storage. You could probably tear this down if you didn't want this type of storage. We're checking this out over here looks like all the pool equipment we have some peeling there so you can sort of see that i'm going to change this because this is sort of like at a bad angle there we go looks like a new heat pump for the pool so this is your pool heater an aqua cell brand new looks like the pool pump that looks like a sand cartridge, or excuse me, a sand filter. All of this looks newer. Your AC unit looks newer. So all of this is really in good shape. I know they love to use the pool. So there's some peeling out in the garage. They did put a utility sink out here. All right, let's go in. Let's see what the code is here. All right. So I walk in here. Looks like these are not sort of like um. Looks like um, LVP flooring. Washer dryers here. Electric box, kitchen's right in the middle here. Really dark cabinets. Definitely has some feel or give to this floor. Just could be wear and tear. We got some skylights here. And then you can see sort of compartmentalized rooms here. So we have an eat-in kitchen. Looks like this is like a quartz or marble countertop. These look to be solid wood. Yep, they're solid wood. Older appliances. Looks like sea glass for the backsplash. So that's sort of pretty. Turtle theme going on. So if you painted these up, probably make it look much bigger in here. 
It's really not a bad layout. It's just, you know, that's not how you would come into the house normally. Looks like primary bedroom here with older carpet. Really good size. There's your pool area. Windows don't look to be in too bad a shape. They are insulated. First bathroom. So it's sort of tight here, bath, or excuse me, toilet here, pedestal sink. Nice tile shower. This definitely could be on the rental market. It was not rented. So you could do some quick fixes, get this on the rental market. Let's see if it's open. Oh, they have a bar in. So really old um, sliders. Nice screened in porch area. And I will tell you this, I live on this lake. It is a gorgeous lake. So if you could trim some of this back, you can sort of see beautiful pavers here. Very pretty pool. And the lake is right behind that. These steps are not real sturdy, I guess. So they said not to use the steps, but you can see you're right. You could put a kayak in right here. So I would clean up some of this. You could have a really nice backyard. Looks like they have a pool cover. Air conditioners over there. Like I said, the exterior it looks like some wood rot. Definitely wood rot. And then you can see the sliders, how they're all rusted. But this is appropriately priced for the current market in Palmetto Dunes. So great outdoor area, great pavers. really has some potential. All right, let's go back in and see the other part of the house where you normally would come in. Let's put the bar back. All right. So when you normally would come in the house, this is the front door. So a nice front door. Windows on both sides, fixed window panes. Looks like bedrooms on that side. Your main living space here. Does look like the top glass is all uh, fogged. Those would need replaced. Those are cosmetic, would, wouldn't be replaced by the owner. And actually this one's being sold as is. Some built-ins on the side. This is actually a pretty good size. Looks like they have some information on this. So maybe they did use this as a rental market. I didn't see that in the write-up, but I will look that up again to make sure. Smooth ceilings, older carpet, so all the flooring would need redone. Need some paint. Might need to punch out a wall here or there to make it a little bit bigger. Refrigerators like right here. So you definitely need to open up this space in my opinion. But it has potential. Let's look at the other side of the house. I like the window here. More storage. Looks like a lot of storage. And then this is bedroom number two. Oh, good size bedroom. This one has 2,200 square feet. 
So two small closets on the side, access to the pool area, lots of windows here. I think this is the primary bed. They're using this as the primary. Lots of closet space here. On both sides, walk-in closets. Bathroom here. Look past the wallpaper. Notice two vanities. That all would need redone. Jetted tub looks newer. Just need to redo around it. So it's got, it's got a lot of space here. So this is definitely used as the primary. And then going here, we have another closet. So that's nice. And then your third bedroom and third bathroom. Oh, we got a old fashioned um, ironing board. This is nice space. see third bed bathroom sort of small all needs redone so let me know what you think about this one like I said it really has a lot to offer, especially the location in Palmetto Dunes. This is one I would definitely think twice about. They're asking $1,250,000 and it's on 0.4 of an acre. Have a great day.